Hi everyone. In this video, I'm going to show you to solve the 2021 anti tenny number five. So we've got a class with more than 12 students. So K, since we have a class K greater than or equal to 12 students. So what this means is that there's K students in the class and there, K is more than 12. So that means there's more than 12 students in the class and they have a mean of eight. Okay. The mean of 12 of these K, remember we know K is more than 12. So 12 out of these K students have a mean of 14. What is the mean of the remaining quiz scores in terms of k? So what is the mean? Mean is just going to be the total sum divided by the number of terms. So what is, in the beginning, since the mean of all, this mean of scores of all k students is 8, we can see that in the beginning, there's going to be 8 times k, which is 8k, total of 8k total points amongst the whole class. Because 8 on average, 8 times k is 8k. So 8k total points of the whole class. But now we know that 12 of these students got an average of 14. So if 12 of these students got an average of 14, and combined, the 12 students got 12 times 14, a score of that. And then what, what is the remaining students? What, how many total remaining students are there? Well, there's going to be K total students. 12 of them got 14, got an average score of 14. So we subtract through K minus 12. We simplify this out. We get 8K minus 168 by K minus 12, which is B. And here's a cool fun fact. If you if you were trying to meta solve this, if you didn't, know, if you didn't know how to solve the problem, you can just assume that k is equal to something like maybe 15, and then you can just basically maybe if, maybe it will be easier for you to think better, and then you can just see which of the option choices your answer would match. So again, another cool application of meta solving, although it probably would, wouldn't be needed for such an easy problem. Thanks all for watching, and see you all next time.